Welcome to the Object Action Language Tutorial. In this series of short video segments, the constructs contained in OAL will be individually discussed and demonstrated. Object Action Language, or OAL, was introduced as part of the Inside XT UML Learning Series. In these 30-minute episodes, the methodology and structure of modeling with executable and translatable UML was shared. Particularly in Episodes 3 and 4, the structure of the XTUML model was described using four layers of detail, with action language being the last and most precise layer. If you are unfamiliar with these episodes, I encourage you to visit XTUML.org and under the Learning tab, they are available as part of the XTUML channel contents on YouTube. Time constraints imposed on these episodes prevented a full exploration of OAL, a gap that will be filled by this tutorial. The tutorial is composed of 19 segments that build on the contents delivered earlier. I recommend that first-time viewers visit each segment in order before picking selections according to their interests. Each segment is between 3 and 6 minutes in length and is intended to be viewed with the XTUML editor also open on the desktop. During each segment, a single OAL construct is demonstrated and discussed. As you follow along, I encourage you to repeat in your own tutorial model the steps presented. The first segment will describe how to set up a workspace to hold the tutorial model and will begin the discussion of OAL, where Episode 4 of the Learning Series concluded. Each segment will build on the preceding material until a fully enhanced model is completed in the last segment. The tutorial is intended to be self-paced, and if questions arise during a segment, there are three places you can look for answers. First, there is the OAL reference, which is available under the Learning tab on XTUML.org. If you don't find the answer there, then the discussion forums on the site are an excellent resource. Lastly, the Inside XTUML on-air discussions are regularly scheduled interactive question and answer sessions that are available to subscribers of the XTUML channel on YouTube. If you are not a subscriber to the channel, I encourage you to join and take advantage of these sessions to ask your OAL question. Thank you for sharing this introduction with me, and I look forward to presenting to you XTUML Object Action Language over the next 19 segments. It's time to proceed to Segment 1 and set up your tutorial workspace.